Hey everybody, John Sposato here from the Arizona Home Group at Keller Williams on behalf of the entire team. Hope you're having a fabulous leap day. <laughs> Got an extra month uh, day this month. I hope you guys are enjoying it and having a great weekend. Anyway, for those of you who follow my videos every month, uh, you know that the market has been pretty hot. We've been keeping you abreast, uh, but things are really starting to take off. Uh, Last week, uh, the Arizona Republic posted that Phoenix housing hits all-time highs. Uh, this week, uh, the Business Journal followed up with that with the Case Shiller report that says uh, that U.S. pricing, uh, housing pricing in Phoenix is the highest in the U.S. Um, two weeks ago, I posted a little Facebook uh, video that said that we had reached a milestone, which was we actually had more homes under contract and pending than we had active, and that was the first time that had happened since 2013 when we were coming out of the bust. Um, so that was around 10,700 homes. Uh, yesterday we've got 10,784 homes for sale, but we've got 12,217 homes under contract. So that gap is widening. We don't have enough inventory to make up for that buyer activity. And here's that buyer activity right here. These are new homes under contract. These are new escrows that are being opened. And you can see how we were down here uh, in January and all of a sudden things have spiked up in the last eight or nine weeks, actually up 14% year over year. So 14% more homes going under contract today than there were a year ago today. Um, so again, the buyer activity is crazy. But it's all price pro points, folks. It's not just the, the lower end price points that we talked about in the past. Uh, here you can see a higher price range, 600 above all the way to 3 million. And you can see that these are up year to date, year over year uh, in closings, up 50, 30, 40, 60%, 113% more closings in the 3 million and up price range year to date than there was last year at this time, okay? These are crazy number, folks, really are. Again, all of that is pushing the downward pressure on inventory down 44% year over year. That, those are unprecedented numbers. I mean, look at that graph. That's, uh, that's unprecedented. So, um, and it's not being helped by new listings that are coming to the market. I showed you this graph two months ago. These are, this is the weekly tracking of new listings that come to the market. And you can see in 2018 and 19 how things paralleled. We get to the end of the year, around the holidays, we get less listings that come to the market. In the beginning of the year, 2020, things pick up and things look like they were normal. Then all of a sudden, boom, in the last couple of weeks, uh, there's been basically no listings coming to the market. Last week, week number nine of the, of the year, week nine had 80 brand new homes to the list to the market, new active homes. 80 homes only, only 80. Look how far that dropped down. Last year at that time, we had 2,444 homes. Homes. Can you believe that? 2,400 versus 80. All right, we don't have any inventory out there and we have lots of buyers. On top of that, interest rates have been going down, especially in the last couple of weeks with the uh, stock market uh, taking a bit of a hit. So when the stock market goes down, bond prices go up and interest rates go down. So interest rates are going down. Uh, people are moving here in droves from the West Coast primarily. Uh, people getting out of the cold weather. Uh, Phoenix is a major influx state. This is turning into a perfect storm where prices are just going to go through the roof for the next couple of years, folks. So if you're a seller, great, congratulations. If you're thinking of selling, that's fantastic. We should sell your house pretty quickly and for top dollar. There's no, there's no doubt about that. If you're a buyer and you're sitting on the fence, you don't know if it's time to buy. Yes, it's time to buy because this is not going to stop. This is not artificial. This is not a bubble. This is basic supply and demand and we don't have enough supply to reach the demand, okay? So reach out to us once again, John, Sharon, Tiffany, Melody, Nicole, Jackie, and John, everyone from the Arizona Home Group, we're here to help. Feel free to reach out. Have a fantastic weekend, and we'll see you next month. Take care.